Asheville High School fires two custodians after learning they had criminal pasts. The two men were hired by an outside company and had been working at the school for the last several months. News 13's Ashley Searle joins us live from the high school. How did it happen, Ashley? Well, tonight it appears that these two men slipped through a crack. Asheville City School says it trusted this company to perform background checks, but the district said today, in this case, this company dropped the ball. Facilico is a contract company. It does custodial work for facilities across the state. It sits five hours east of us, but a mistake made there has now been traced to Asheville. Well, about a week ago, we got a call from a media outlet in another part of the state asking about this company. Asheville City Schools hired Facilico, and it turned out that Facilico had hired two men with criminal pasts and put them to work at Asheville High. We're terminated the day we found out. That was on September the 4th. The district said it couldn't reveal specifics about the men's criminal records, but says they were both primarily performing custodial duties after school let out, not often with kids, and there were never any incidents reported. 700 employees and 4,300 students, that's 5,000 people. So there are things that happen. Uh, people have issues. This is, again, unfortunate, but uh, something that I would say wholeheartedly did not put students in danger. No, I don't like the idea of a criminal record, anybody with a criminal record working at a school. That, that doesn't sound good. We spoke to half a dozen Asheville High parents. All were surprised, but just one said they were worried. But in, in fairness, if they're not working with children, then that that may be considered. Without knowing exactly what was on their criminal record, I can't really make a judgment. The facilities and human resources departments for the district are now taking a look at policy to see if something more foolproof can be put in place so this won't happen again. We do background checks on every adult that comes in contact with children or, you know, that we employ, of course, and then when it's a contractor, we require that of them. Now, we reached out to this company, Facilico, over the phone this afternoon. They did not return calls for comment. But now, for the district's part, they say they signed this contract with the company for the first time, working with them for the first time this summer, and they're going to stick to that contract. Reporting live tonight in Asheville, I'm Ashley Searles, News 13.